Listing Diario Editorial for March 11th of 2024. Secret Negotiations The Dominican government assumed a responsible attitude by preventing its territory from being used as an aerial springboard to facilitate the return of Ariel Henry to Haiti in the middle of last week. The reason given by President Luis Abinader is that Henry is not welcome in the country for security reasons. Given that a moment of tension and violence prevails in which armed gangs challenge the authority of the government of that country. On the eve of the aborted plan by the United States and Haiti to re-enter Henry in Port-au-Prince, the Dominican government reported that it had been consulted informally about such purposes, and that on two occasions he made the reservation that it was impossible to allow the indefinite stopover of the plane that will bring him if he did not previously receive a defined flight plan. The surprising thing is that once these conditions were established, the plane that was bringing Henry from an airport in the North American city of New Jersey ignored this requirement and headed towards our country, although it later had to land in Puerto Rico. A version of the newspaper El Nuevo Geral has revealed that Dominican officials had secretly negotiated the landing even though it did not finally take place. This is when the Herald's revelation is unprecedented and worrying because it transcended the decision made by the National Security Council two days before, after the informal consultations that were held with the United States and Haiti. It is healthy that this episode is properly contextualized because in the current circumstances in which the country faces threats to its security due to the crisis in Haiti, a secret negotiation with the original purposes is inadmissible because it puts our own sovereignty at stake, since no country can dictate to ours policies or actions that violate the framework of its constitutional or strategic powers to decide how to act in the face of this conflict. It is dangerous in the current circumstances that by accepting pressures and decisions that suit other strategic interests, maneuvers or plays under the table are admitted to favor any type of solutions to the Haitian crisis, compromising our security and our sovereignty. For Listing Diario, voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez.